Hey guys, what's up? Another week. Another time to see what I got. Have, let's have a peek. Anyway, good, good, <laughs> good, good day to you guys and ladies and everything in between. I am exhausted. I had a very rough week at work. I had a rough week at work, like a lot of people. Um, okay. I had a rough week at work, like a lot of people. Nothing really bad happened. It's just that you get home, you're tired. You, you know, it, it's different. Very different. You know, when you have a, I would call it a, sit down job it's all mental because i remember used to have physical jobs before you know you get tired you take a couple of hours rest and boom you're good to go when you're mentally exhausted you're like uh, you're like drooling like Rah. like when you wake up and you're like when you go to sleep you wake up you, you find out you was drooling that's the how you feel every day <clears throat> you know and you know me like a lot of my other co-workers you know, we're trying to find the energy to, you know, to make it through the day. And sometimes it works, sometimes it don't. But anyway, how are you guys doing? So, yeah, I just got back from the comic book shop. I worked this morning. And I was exhausted. Funny thing is, after two hours, I learned I don't feel like working anymore. But I got to make it to five, this five hours. Five hours, boom in the can went to the comic book store just technically just took put my clothes in the dryer for the second cycle S slipped into this and let's make this video let's make this video before I go to sleep let's make this video before somebody calls me trust me I don't you know or whatever or I gotta do something for the family whatever a lot of times, you want to just veg out. Don't do nothing. But anyway. <clears throat> so, um, the one, that, one of my favorite YouTube channels, The Batman, he had this video up and he it was talking about Uncanny Avengers, number one. One of the things, I haven't even back and board through these yet. That's how fresh I just got home. And the funny thing is, there was an Uncanny Avengers before, after the A versus X, and they, you know, kind of merged, but that seems interesting. We got uh, Dark Vader, Dark, for the Dark Droids TV, not TV, storyline. Daredevil 14. Night Terrors Nightwing number two. Now the hilarious thing is, is that I've been hearing some good things and some bad things about this Night Terror storyline. And I'm like, eh, this is something I might want to actually read now. Another thing that the Batman suggested was Dang, I don't have my glasses with me. World's Finest 18. Supposedly the origin of the world's finest. Even though this they've been around forever. And Dark X-Men number one. I've been waiting. You know, a friend of mine told me. He said, dude, Dark X-Men one looks good. And then online I heard about a story. That's coming out very soon. I'm like, there's no way. No way. Then I realized Marvel owns these Disney Disney owns these properties. Wolverine versus Predator. Now that should be a story. Now that should be a good story. Dragged out, bloody, and super violent. But you know it's not gonna be. 
I got some stuff in the mail. Stuff in the mail. Now, I, I could have sworn I had this book a long time ago. I could have sworn I did when I was a kid. I could have sworn it, but King Size Avengers no, Annual Number 7. King Size Annual Number 7. Has Big Baddie Thanos in the background. So I'm like, yeah, this should be good. For some reason, like I said, I, I could have sworn I had it a long time ago, but I don't remember. This right here is Daredevil 161. I love this cover. Bullseye kicking the crap out of Daredevil on a roller coaster. And Black Widow's tied up. And this one right here, this is a shocker for me to find. And I got it at a very decent price. Ready? Daredevil 27. If you look at what this, this looks like a really, really fresh copy. I was like, there's no way this is for this price. There's no way. There's a reason. Let's open it up. Because I had to look at it. Because like, for this price, I got to see. Water damage right there. There we go. But other than that, the pages look nice and good for newsstand. Oh, yeah, that's right. It's not water. It's ripped. That's why it's 30 bucks. And I was like, hey, this is not bad. Ain't it? For this price, this isn't, this isn't, this isn't bad for that kind of price. Especially for a good, this is a, this is a cover that I kind of would love to have. Guest starring the, dang it. One of you will, I'm pretty sure one of you will remind me to say, Art, put on your dang glasses, man. Reading glasses, that is. Guest starring the one and an imitable Spider-Man. Who's afraid of the stilt, man? Featuring the honest to gosh end of the mask, Marauder. For some reason, I think I know this villain somewhere. I, I heard this character from somewhere, but don't know where, but that's okay. You know what? And that's end. That's the end of the comic books for the, all for the week. Yes, nothing flashy. Very simple. Lots of stuff going on. And um, hoping, hopefully, hopefully you guys are having a great day. Hopefully you have a great week. And what I'm going to do now is I'm going to, while this loading up to YouTube to be to be published, I'm thinking I'm going to take a nap. If my nieces will let me. With that being said, thanks very much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, share this video if you like as well. And I'll see you in another one.